A 10 year old boy found dead after his family's northwest side home catches fire Friday. His death has been ruled accidental. Michelle Fiore is live outside the home for us tonight with more. Michelle. Natalie and Jessup, good evening to you both. Neighbors tell us that since the fire happened a couple of days ago, it's been very difficult to look at this boarded up house behind us. People have been dropping off balloons and teddy bears, all to honor the young life of a Milwaukee public school student. This is Justin Williams and his pit bull mix named Ace. Firefighters first on scene began putting out the flames, then discovered the boy and his dog together, but it was too late. They immediately began extinguishing the fire in the front of the structure, made their way around to the rear where they encountered a fortified storm door with multiple locks on it. Uh, they were able to, to quickly force through that door and they found a 10 year old uh, child, male child and uh, the family dog uh, in the kitchen on the floor. When smoke alarms began blaring in the home Friday night near 118th and Florist, the medical examiner's report says Justin's mom began yelling to the kids to wake up. His sister crawled through a bedroom window. Justin and Ace in the basement made it to the first floor before being overcome by smoke. Smoke has a narcotic effect, so it'll disorient you very quickly, uh, physically and visually, uh, where you are unable to you know, find your way out sometimes. So. We very much stress uh, practicing exit drills from every room in your house. Investigators learned a candle on top of an ottoman somehow ignited the furniture. Word of the fatal fire spread fast to neighbors on this tight knit block. We're all very just heartbroken with them. There's no way that I don't know how she's going to get through this, but she will. Um, and his father, too. I did see him quite a bit, too. A GoFundMe is set up to help the florist fire victims, and we'll have a link on our page, cbs58.com. Now, firefighters found a dog crated in the basement, still alive. That dog now being cared for by a neighbor. And we've learned that Justin's mom and sister are now out of the hospital. Reporting live on the Northwest Side, I'm Michelle Fiore, CBS 58 News.